Welcome to Vacuum Wars and to our review of the NC cordless vacuum lineup. I bought four of their best selling models and put them through all kinds of tests this week to see which one of them was the best and how they stack up against their competition. So links in the description and let's get started. I have them lined up here from the least to the most expensive, but they're all in what I would consider the budget cordless vacuum category, where even the most expensive one, the S610, is about half the cost of the average cordless vacuum that I have reviewed. They all have the same basic stick vacuum design with two of them, the N5S and the S610, looking almost identical to one another on the surface, but they all have their slight differences. For example, they all have LED lights and all but the N6 have a removable battery, though the number of LED lights and the type and size of removable battery are a little different. Also, although their floor heads seem similar at first glance, all of them have different designs with different brushes and different styles of front gates, which can affect how well they perform on various surfaces. So let's get into the tests, because this is where their real differences start to show up. With all the power tests, like sealed suction, unsealed suction, and airflow at the base and head, the S610 was significantly better than the others. In fact, the S610 was the only one that had power scores that I would consider above average. The S610 and N6 tied for the best scores on the crevice pickup test and the carpet deep clean test, where we embed sand into medium pile carpet to see how good they are at picking up deeply embedded debris. These scores are pretty decent for budget cordless vacuums. For example, all the NC cordless vacuums scored better than all three Pretty Care cordless vacuums, which we reviewed a while back and are in a similar price range. They were all pretty similar with their ability to pick up debris from the surfaces of hard floors and carpet. They did really well with small, medium, and large debris on hard floors, and a little bit better than that on carpet, with the exception of the N6, which struggled with Cheerios on hard floors because of its small openings on the floor head. And although some of them could pick up extra large debris like Fruit Loops, at least on carpet, all of their air intakes got clogged with debris that size, which is typical of many cordless vacuums, but worth mentioning. The N6 was the lightest of them and by a good margin, with the heaviest being the S610 and V70, but none of them were what I would consider heavy for cordless vacuum handles. They all had very similar battery life numbers at about 45 minutes on low power and roughly 20 minutes on their max power mode, with the V70 having slightly less runtime than the others. They were all quieter than average in our noise test, with the N6 being the most quiet. The two that look alike, the S610 and N5S, have really large dust bins, much higher than average. They all had the same basic filtration ability that you would expect from vacuums in this price range, which is to say they weren't very good good with filtration in my opinion. Their attachment sets were very similar with decent quality tools. They all have some kind of wall mount. I particularly liked their dusting brush slash upholstery tool, which all of them come with a version of except for the N6. So when you add all of these numbers up, the S610 is the winner with a vacuum or score right at the average amount of all the other cordless vacuums I've tested, which isn't that bad when you consider that I mostly review more expensive cordless vacuums. Because the S610 model was so much more powerful than the others, it really is the only NC cordless vacuum that I would recommend of the ones I've tested here. To recap, the S610, which comes in two different color options, had great pickup on hard floors and carpet, above average deep clean scores, it's got decent weight and ease of use scores, and a useful attachment set at a budget price. Links in the description, and be sure to subscribe to Vacuum Wars before you leave. Thanks for watching.